Take every chance and every opportunity you get to learn from the people you work for, right? Whether it's your direct boss, your supervisor, or maybe even the chief executive officer or the chairman of the business or the organization, or maybe it's one and the same. Maybe you do report to the CEO. In any event, keep learning every single day and keep paying attention to what they do. Not only what they say, but what they actually do every single day, right? Short of someone coming from extremely wealthy family and just starting a business to so they would have something to do, and I've seen that happen, by the way, uh, they got to their top position somehow. They had to know something or someone, which is then politics, which is extremely important, right? I was not a fan of, you know, politicking, so to speak, in the corporate world a decade or two ago. But I've learned to accept it. Because with politics, you either play them or you get played. So make sure you incorporate that into your skill set as you keep growing, developing, and advancing in your own career. But it is extremely important to learn from both good moves and decisions that your boss or the overall CEO has made and bad ones. Think about, listen to what the community is saying. Listen to what your organization is saying. What are people who are two or three levels down thinking about that individual? Right? Do they even know who he or she is? Do they see them? Are they, do they have opportunities to interact with them? Learn. Always learn. Pay attention. Keep your ears and eyes open. And see what they're doing as they're traversing through their own careers. Because they're ahead of you, whether you like it or not. It is important to learn as much as you can so that you are properly equipped and prepared for when you become the CEO one day. Chances are in a different organization, but learn as much as you can, right? There's an old saying that goes something along the, along the lines of, you know, silly person learns from their own mistakes, smart person learns from the mistakes of others, and an idiot never learns. Well, number one, don't be an idiot. And number two, try to be smart if you can. No sense in repeating mistakes of others. If you see that someone is doing certain things that do not work, that create issues, tension, problems, that are somewhat short-sighted, and they're not looking three, five, seven, ten years ahead, because that is one of the toughest requirements of leaders, and that is vision. Being able to get everyone on board and take that ship, you know, many, many thousands thousands of miles away from here to the point where people can't even see anything. All they see is the horizon and water everywhere. But you know that somewhere out there, there's a, you know, a beautiful island or a beach that you need to get to. It is your responsibility to motivate everyone, get them all on the same page, and get them all to work together towards that common goal, right? Towards that island, so to speak. So do whatever you can And take every chance and every opportunity you get to learn from your boss and their boss if you don't report directly to the CEO. It will be the best and the biggest school you ever get for free. And not only for free, they're actually paying you to be there, right? Whether it's salary or hourly, it doesn't matter. You're actually being paid to be there. So this is free, hands-on, real-world education. Take advantage of it. Have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best. Subscribe, comment, and share. Share this video with someone who could learn a thing or two from their boss. Have a great day.